This is not going to go the way you think. All right, y'all, here we go. Rambo, Last Blood, the no-spoiler two-minute review. So this movie takes place roughly 10 years after the events of the fourth movie. So we see that Rambo's taken over the family ranch, and Rambo's niece and her grandmother live on the ranch with him, and her mother died of cancer when she was very young, her dad ran off, so he's serving as sort of the father figure. Now things go south pretty quick, and Rambo's got to go to Mexico to rescue his niece. So that's all I'm going to give you for the story, but let me just say I was disappointed. And in some way, I think... I set myself up for failure. I think I may have set my expectations a little too high. This movie is not a cheesy action movie. This is not like Expendables 4. And no one goes into a Rambo film expecting to see some good, wholesome family entertainment. But this is definitely the darkest film in the series. And the blood and the guts and the gore are definitely there, don't get me wrong. But it was more computer generated and I think practical effects would have just looked so much better. I mean, there's some brutal maiming kills, but they happen so quick, it's almost like if you could have held that maybe a half second or a second more, you could have really taken that in and realized, damn, that just happened. So to sum this all up, I think the fourth movie was better. I think the fourth movie served the character better. I think the ending of the fourth movie was, was a fitting end for Rambo, and I think this movie is almost like Rocky V. It felt unnecessary. And if you hang around, there is like a mid credit scene after they show sort of a montage of all the different films that came before it that actually confused me about the ending of the movie. If you see it, you'll know what I'm talking about. So unfortunately for me, Last Blood is going to rank last in all the Rambo films. So anyway, y'all, those are my thoughts on the film. Like the video if you like it. Subscribe if you like the content. Y'all have a blessed day, and I will see you next time.